Knowledge exchange, or KE, is about generating the most value from research. Like many things in life, it's about perspective. KE looks outwards and views research as an investment to help solve complex issues. It sees research as a resource and not just a publication. A KE perspective appreciates the value of practice-based and real-world knowledge as much as research evidence. It acknowledges the growing shift towards consumer involvement to ensure informed research directions. It understands that if research is to be applied, then clearly it needs to be relevant, timely and communicate in ways that meet the needs of those who will ultimately use it. Simply, if you want your research to make a difference, then KE needs to be part of your core business. KE is a cultural mind shift that values engagement beyond academic circles. It means identifying and working with your customers, such as policymakers, practitioners and consumers from the outset. This allows you to incorporate real world knowledge and skills into your work. So take the time at the outset to assess who might benefit from your research. Work out the best ways to connect and engage with them, and critically, to really think how your work can offer value to them. By working together, pragmatically, we can achieve greater value from research. As context, it is helpful also to understand how your research fits with local and national priorities policies and timeframes so you know that it is relevant. Of course, this process takes time and resources. However, building trusting relationships with the people who will use your research is not only professionally rewarding, it will inform and enable the progress, outcomes and dissemination of your work. Once you start thinking KE, there are a raft of strategies and tools you can use, many of which are mentioned in the following suite of videos. Above all, if you want your research to have an impact, then you need to build your networks. Take the time to create and maintain close and trusting links with your peers, internal research teams, and the users of your research right from the beginning. <laughs>